today we will study a topic encoder 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 it is a digital function that produce a reverse operation of the decoder okay it is a digital function that produces that produces a reverse operation of from decoder okay an encoder has an encoder has 2 to the power n inputs input lines and n output lines okay encoder is reverse function of decoder it has 2 to the power n inputs line and n output lines okay the octal to binary encoder consists as eight inputs okay one of them digits are three outputs that generate the corresponding binary equation okay for example if we take a for example if we take a octal to binary encoder what it is doing it's encoding okay so there is a need of or gate 3 why because eight inputs and so the 2 to the power 3 is equals to eight inputs and three outputs so this will be connected to as for example if d0 d1 d2 d3 d4 d5 d6 d7 this is a table and x y z gives you a this is the input this is an output okay so this will be otherwise all these lines will be zero when d1 is connected all lines are zeros when d2 is connected other lines are zero then d3 d4 d5 d6 is connected then d7 so this shows that x y z we get a output 0 for d1 we will written as in binary form 0 0 for d2 it is 0 1 0 okay for d2 it showing that it is connected with d2 in a binary form encoding in output we get it 0 1 0 means it shows that d2 line is connected similarly for 3 for 4 for 5 for 6 and lastly 7 okay then lines will be connected in this way that if we want d0 so the line will connected to d0 if we want d1 means x is equals to 1 1 so see here this is for x this is for y this is for z okay from here we can see that x is 1 when it is connected to d4 d4 d5 d6 d7 okay so we will here make here d0 d1 d2 d3 d4 d5 d6 d7 so x will get an output when 
it is connected to d4 d5 d6 d7 means it's connected d4 d5 d6 and d7 so the output of y will be 1 when d2 d3 and d6 d7 are connected d2 is connected similarly d3 is connected and d6 is connected and d7 is connected okay similarly for z it is for 1 for 3 then for 5 and 7 1 3 5 7 means it will connect it to d1 then d3 so the d3 connection we can do it like this way okay and d6 d7 d7 and d6 so it's showing that in the x output we get it d4 plus d5 plus d6 plus d7 in y similarly we get it for the d2 plus d3 then d6 plus d7 for z also d1 plus d3 plus d5 plus d7 so th this is a encoder okay it is encoding the languages means it's encoding the any decimal digits into a binary in the form of binary it is a encoder now we will study a multiplexer okay so it means it transmitting a large number of information over a small number of channels or lines okay there are many input and limited output the best way to understand multiplexer is there are many inputs and limited outputs it transmitting transmitting a large number of information into over a smaller numbers of channels or lines okay means a digital multiplexer is a combinational circuit that selects binary information from one of many input lines and direct it to the single output lines okay this is a multi Multiplexer means multiplexer kya hai humare ek combinational circuit hai jisme binary information rehti hai bhoot saari input lines hoti hai direct kata hai ek single output line mein hume bhoot saari cheeze mil sakti hai thik hai thik hai isme hum selection kiya jata hai input lines ka selection lines rehti hai there are 2 to the power n inputs line and n selection lines so there is many multiplexer for line to one line multiplexers okay and four to one line multiplexer two to one line multiplexers so they are many multiplexers for example if we take four to one line multiplexer marks it can a graphical symbol shows that input zero one, two, three. Okay, it's a four cross one means output we get it y. And there will be select line. So two to the power n n shows a select lines. Okay. So two to the power two is equals to four. Four means 
input and this shows that select lines okay so we will make it as there will be and gates four and gates it will be connected as to the single output into the or gate which gives you a y output okay the truth table will be in this form means x1 x0 okay y output if 0 0 means i0 is connected 0 1 is for i1 0 1 0 for i2 then 1 1 for i3 so we will make it x and y there will be not gate also for showing it in water x1 and x0 when it is connected to 0 0 means i0 is connected okay like this way means if we giving a 0 0 it is connected to this similarly it is for i0 for i1 will be 0 and 1 okay so there will be a i1 line then it is 0 1 means 0 for x1 and 1 for x0 similarly for i3 also i2 means i2 1 and 0 and for i3 we i3 1 and 1 so this is a r multiplexer okay this is a topic of multiplexer in which it can there are so many inputs and giving a one output